So I happened to catch a captive squirrel this morning um, out in the fence in the backyard. Um, just to illustrate how effective the Topaz Video AI stabilization uh, can be if you have trouble like I do with shaky hands while trying to handhold uh, your camera and lens while filming, especially filming moving wildlife and moving animals. Um, on the left hand side of the illustration you'll see that this is the stabilized copy of the video that I had originally shot. When you compare it to the unstabilized on the right you'll see very quickly that the movement of the trees has been oh, kind of slowed down a little bit um, and, and, and blurred uh, just a little bit during the, the transition. Uh, but the overall quality and stability of the video was improved tremendously by just using the stabilization inside of Topaz Video AI. By default, it's set to 50% um, as a program default. I upped it to 80% because the shaking was so bad on my original footage, which unfortunately for a lot of my video uh, that I shoot, it is extremely unstable because I do admittedly have a terrible time trying to keep my camera uh, hand still uh, regardless of what I do outside of using a tripod. You'll notice if you watch any of my other videos on the channel, I have a lot of concert footage. And one thing that they all have in common, if I haven't stabilized them, is that there's a ton of camera shake, unfortunately. Uh, so as a means of trying to help resolve to a point uh, that problem, because obviously most of the things that most of us shoot are going to be handheld and moving around in a lot of cases, unless you happen to be in a spot where you can set up a tripod and, and follow the action. Um, so what I found so far with the Topaz Video AI, it, it is extremely effective if you do have trouble um, stabilizing your hands and stabilizing your lens while trying to take handheld footage. Um, would I recommend it as a whole so far? A little early to tell. I've only been using it for a couple of weeks uh, through a couple of videos, but I am very impressed with it. Uh, so far, and I will continue to make additional follow-up videos to cover some of the other features within Topaz Video AI. And special thanks to Camera Conspiracies, uh, another camera channel um, on YouTube for recommending this product and, and displaying a lot of uh, wildlife uh, footage uh, processed through uh, Video AI. Um, thanks again for the recommendation. Um, taking you up on it, and so far seem to be very happy with it.